Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Hello. Isn't it magical when you get your delivery from Amazon? Um, it really is. What? So I have uh, something here that I'm really excited about. <laughs> You're going to hate it, and I'm going to love it, and I'm going to try really, really hard not to sing. Who's who's going to hate it? Me or the viewers? Uh-oh. You! <laughs> I love Frozen! <laughs> yep, that's me. You know what will help unfroze them? Some nice hot Tabasco. Oh, you can ask Elsa if she wants that. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. I, I was gonna. Give she my, does like fire spirits. I was gonna give my spiel right now, but I'll wait. You should um, wait. Totally. Totally wait. Should I wait for her or someone else? Though? <laughs> so clever that dragon. <laughs> All right. So here, <laughs> here we have something. Um, I have been looking at Anna and Elsa dolls for a very, very long time, and I just haven't found any that are like, "Yay, buy me!" <laughs> but this is a special box of the Disney Collector. Frozen dolls. Ooh, so inside we get Anna too. and Elsa. This one retails for one hundred dollars. Wait, what? But Amazon had a flash sale for thirty dollars. Oh, okay. So I'm like, now is the time. <laughs> it doesn't get better than that for thirty dollars. Let's see what's in this box, shall we? Mm-hmm. Stab the. I'm gonna cut that box up. Hey, what's that? What? They're here. Just talk to me. Just like that. <gasps> there they are. <laughs> Anna and Elsa. So, like I said, I do love Frozen. I've been looking at the dolls, but, you know, they have a $10 doll. They have a $20 doll. They have a $30 doll. And none of them really looked good to me. Um, yeah, you've shown, um, me, you've shown me some at, like, Target and other big yeah, box stores. You're like, here, just, look at these. And I'm like, um. They're just not what I was looking for in a doll. And all you see is ring like wear. So Those actually look I was Decent. really excited when I saw that Mattel does have a collector version and that then they went on a flash sale. It's the it you know, it's the time to buy them when they're on that crazy price of thirty bucks. Was it the perfect storm? Uh no, it's just Kismet. It was Kismet and Isn't that the variant of Yahtzee? <gasps> Look at how beautiful right, they though. are in the box. Those lovely sisters <laughs> who have rooted eyelashes and oh. Anna's adorable freckles. Whoa. We have some great hair and some very sparkly outfits. And the good doll stands. There we go. Let's uh, figure out how to take these out of the Dude, box. Hold on. Hold on. Are, are you sure this is a Disney toy? Because, like, every time, like, you've shown Brian Disney toys, um, he's, like, not impressed. Yeah, um, right here. But... Celebrate Disney 100 Whoa. Years of Wonder with this Wait. collector edition so, set Disney... that captures Anna and Elsa in sparkling detail. The Elsa doll enchants in an icy blue satin gown and glittering chiffon cape while Anna, sorry, Anna, the doll shines in her satin and metallic woven dress with a velvety cape and a fur-trimmed hat. Together, these dolls celebrate the magic of sisterhood. Yeah, thanks for all that. Anyways, mm -hmm. um, Disney and Mattel. And it, yeah, it looks, right? You, there it is, happening? right there. No, Mattel makes some really, really, really good stuff, but it's all, like, the really high-end price tag. Like, I have some great Mattel dolls. I'm not knocking Mattel. I am. This they make some Mattel. really nice stuff. It's just you got to spend you gotta spend some coin to get the, <laughs> the really nice stuff. All right. Um, here we have lots of plastic. I'm going to save you having to hear it. But it's my turn to shine. I don't think we need you. Oh. I'm sorry, Stabatha. Oh. But we really can just, we can just pull these apart. Look at that. <laughs> I guess that's, oh, that's what you. Fancy. I guess that's what you get when you spend the. All right. Thirty dollars. <laughs> yeah. I, again, I picked these up on a flash sale. So if you've been eyeing them up, just wait for a flash sale. And that's good stuff. Hold on. You don't need to wait through this. Hi, Sherman. Hey. I didn't do anything. I swear. What are you doing? Hurry it up. I'm trying to fix her, but Elsa's dress is really form fitting and really doesn't like this doll stand. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. That's amazing, though. I'm you know. just going to sit here and watch. She's beautiful. Flip, flip. Should you be flip, watching? Flip. Oh, we're doing our flip, flip. dance. No. Don't, don't embarrass me. You can do your flip dance to make yourself happy. Live flip, your best flip. life, Sherman. Flip, flip. Flip, flip. You got another, what, 10 minutes? Probably. It's been like 18. It's me playing with the toys. Yes. Playing okay. with your toys. I'm just like you, like, okay, years. struggling. <gasps> I don't struggle. Well, with that doll stand you are. No, I'm not. <laughs> And there they are. Fancy. There are Anna and Elsa. And I have to say, yes. So please remove the cone of shame from Anna's skirt. It doesn't <laughs> need to be there. 
<laughs> it's just Fish to, wrap. It's just to keep it so it's all puffed out in the box. Hmm. So here we have Miss Princess Anna. Because this is Frozen 1. This is not Frozen 2, everyone. She has lovely rooted eyelashes. Look at those lashes. Fancy. So pretty. Look at that face. Okay, so her bangs need a little bit of work. I'm sorry, we call it fringe now. Her fringe does need just a little bit of work, but that's okay. Her freckles, adorable. She has a loose, a loose hair on her face, but that's gone now. <laughs> her little fur trimmed and velvet cap. Oh my goodness, it's adorable, Anna. So, in manufacturing, do they have like Look machines that like braid and then um? Actually, it's usually spray paint the hair. Or it's usually spray paint. Spray I mean, paint. What are you doing? <laughs> don't spray paint. Spray. Sorry. Look, anyone who plays with dolls knows we don't use hairspray. <laughs> or we use hairspray. We don't use spray paint. Don't spray yeah, paint the confused. dolls. Yeah, I know. Do not spray paint the dolls. Let me be abundantly clear. Oh, Do no. not spray paint them. Um, all right, so yes, Princess Anna, I have heard um, a mixed bag for hair, and some factories do actually have people who take the time to braid in style. Mm -hmm. And depending on the dolls, other ones are machine. So it okay. de it just depends on what the doll is and what they're doing. Just curious, don't know. But her Whoa. cape is velvet, and Whoa. look at that lining. Like we get this really fancy, shiny lining all the way around it. Are we sure? Oh, this I'm is sorry. Mattel? The word I'm looking for is trim. This really sure fancy this trim all the way around our velvet. Yes, it's Mattel. Mm. And then on the opposite side, it's fully lined satin. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. And look at this dress. So it's actually a two-piece outfit for us. So our doll can mix and match. <laughs> we get a two-piece ensemble. Ensemble. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. But look at that face. Like This is the prettiest Anna doll that I have personally seen. I haven't seen... Any with quite that pretty face. Like, yes, her bangs are very crunchy. Are we done yet? Like, I've got, like, cookies in the oven. That's why I'm wearing oven mitts. Can we take your hat off? Hold on, I'm inspecting. Oh, my gosh, no, it's sewn to your head. Can you take their face off? Okay, um, you can, you can take the hat off. So there is a little piece that goes underneath her pigtails. Sorry, this folks in Elsa. We have a little piece that goes under the pigtails, but you can actually detach it. There is... A super tiny thread there at the top if you do want you to want take to her cap up? off. No, we're not going to do that right now. I just wanted to see if you can take them off. Sometimes you can't. Can They're actually sewn off? into the head. Um, yeah, I suppose her head could come off, but let's not do that today. We're not going to do that today. She does get these lovely Oven mittens. Mitts. Look at those. She's all set for a ride on a sleigh. Oh. Looks like she's about to larry somebody. And I have to say, her you outfit is that. her outfit is fantastic. It's got such great detail. It has so many layers to it. So we get trim, we get embroidery, we get shimmer. That's good stuff. And her boots. Look at those boots. The important part. She does have curled toes on her boots, which I appreciate the little extra detail. Let's <laughs> check out her toes because dolls are the only acceptable one to look at the toes on. Oh. There they are. So cute. Not painted, but adorable. And... What we were looking for there was an articulated ankle, which she does not have one. Oh, okay. However, she does have lots of other articulation. She gets the shoulder, the wrist, and the elbow movements. Look, she can do this. <laughs> if you want her to. She can bend at the waist, but there's no twist. And the important, she can, oh, sorry. Sorry, Anna. She can sit in a chair because she has an articulated knee, which not all collector dolls have. Now, is she the frozen one? Uh, she does get frozen. Does that count? Um, I can help pull her out. Perfect. So. We'll need you later. <sighs> okay, so that is Princess Anna. And the most important part is they get the good doll stands that don't mess up their outfits. I think that's what you're really paying for in a collector doll. Am I wrong? Like the good oh, doll stands? Oh, because it's not like a thing that grabs them at their waist from behind. Yeah, it doesn't ruin the outfit. You can pose. You can still pose them in all kinds of ways. Um, you also get the rooted eyelashes in the collector dolls, and you get more detail. So, like, the capes will be velvet, but they'll also be trimmed. And the hats will have detail and trim. Fancy. And they got such pretty faces. Let's take a look and at... And oven mitts. Let's take a look at Miss Elsa, shall we? Here is Queen Elsa, because this is the first movie. She's a queen. All right, here we go. Wait, wait hold on, excuse me. Mm -hmm. um, like, queens are rich, right? 
Not all of Does them. She like to play pool for money. She would totally school you. <laughs> okay. Totally. Okay. Well, let's see her put her money where her mouth is. It's right there. Like, uh, yeah. yeah. Elsa would win. Okay, so here is Queen Elsa. She has rooted eyelashes. Very fancy. She has blue her, streaks. you know, her signature braid. She always has her hair in a braid. Fancy blue. And she does get some uh, glitter in there that's blue. That's fancy. Some blue glitter just to give it a little shimmer, which it makes yeah. sense. So it's not just a and flat color. On my hands. She is, that's from her dress. <laughs> well, whatever. There's glitter on my hands. She has a very pretty face. Look at that makeup with the purple eyeshadow and that deep burgundy lip. She's so pretty. No, I'll definitely, uh, I'll Look definitely... at that head movement, too. Like, she gets a tilt, side to side, and front and back. No, pause. Good stuff. Yes, I'm amazing. <laughs> they do actually look like their cartoon counterparts. They do. They're, these are actually really, really, really well good dolls. sculpted and designed. And if we want to take a look at her dress, um, I do really like the skin tone that they chose for Elsa. It's... Also, do they have the same one? It it's looks... pale and translucent like your own. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Anna has a little bit more color to her cheeks, but Elsa is this lovely, lovely pale. I really, really like when they do like a really, really pale skin tone on dolls. And then they gave her that dark lip. Her dress is fantastic. Hold on, her elbow is twisted the wrong way, so that looks a little off-putting. <laughs> Her dress is fantastic. She gets lots of layers of textures and colors. So, of course, she has this icy blue color for the whole thing. She gets a shimmer on the top, so it's a shimmer, like a prismatic print on top of a satin. And then she gets a glitter print on top of a satin on the bottom, which is also on top of a net. Oh. So she gets a satin, a net, and a glitter. Funicello? Exactly. Whoa. And then on top of the netting on the top of her bodice, she gets all of this glitter print with her snowflakes, just to give her that sparkle, because it's Elsa. And then top it off with a huge cape! And the cape's pretty amazing. Look at that cape with the prismatic snowflakes. That is really, really pretty. She is a very, very pretty doll. And the most important part is, of course, the fancy kicks. Hmm. It is a see-through ice shoe that goes up the ankle. Steel-toed. So she has the same art... <laughs> I'm, I, sure, why not? She has the same articulation as Anna, so she does not have the ankle articulation, but all the other points are there. And I would say totally worth the price point. She is a very, very, very pretty doll. Yeah, that's all well and good, but like in the break room, I had a potato. I was going to eat it for lunch. Have you guys seen it? Let it go, let it go. I already ate your potato. Wow. It was tasty. Can't argue with Ridiculous. a queen. Ridiculous. You can't There's... argue with a queen. I'm sorry, Jerome. We'll get you another potato. Theodore. Theodore. Sorry, Theodore. Or replace your potato. She eating potatoes? That's we'll get, amazing. We'll get you some, too. Okay. Potatoes for all! I just think they're neat. Boil them, mash them, <laughs> put them in a stew. Name that movie. I'll take some stew. Hmm. Me, too. What kind would you like? Potato. Cool. Beans. I like... Um, Okay. Lobs? No, I don't want lobs. Oh, no, no, Nobody don't, likes don't, lobs. Don't, don't stop that. Blech. Stop that. All right. Is there lobster stew? No, there's no lobster mm. stew. So if we remove Princess Anna's cape, <gasps> look happening? at this cape. Look at how much detail is on these dolls. They're so pretty, and it's so nicely finished. She even has, like, these fun bobbles. Okay, that's super fun. I really like to make mouse ears with these baubles. If you <laughs> want to see them, let me know in the comments. Oh my gosh, they're so fun. Oh, oh look at I her. Don't... She looks just like the movie, Anna. She's so fun. And yes, you can take her mittens off. I just don't really want to. But I will for, you know, purpose of video. Look at her little Nordic mitts. They're so adorable. That is fantastic. You know how long it takes to knit these? A really long time. <laughs> but look at her. She's great. All right, so that's enough, I guess, ooing and eyeing over Anna and Elsa. Tim, you've never looked better. <laughs> it's a little big. I do appreciate just all of the detail in these. Like, every time you turn them around, like, the different angles, you get a different... They're all finished, and it's nice. You get a different view of the doll. They look fantastic. 
from all of the layers of sparkles and the different use of sparkles. Like it's not all glitter. So you get a prismatic print, you get a glitter, you get a tool, you get a chiffon layer. You have so many layers going on here that it makes them have so many distinct details. Like it, <laughs> it really sets them apart from like a one layer screen printed dress is what I'm trying to say. Like they really do look like they are worth their price tag. Mm. Now, if you, like, this is the first time I've seen doll stands like this, because, you know. I Mariah know. Carey totally had Did one. Did she? Yeah. Well, she was creepy. Anyway. Mariah was beautiful. <laughs> what? Stop it. Mariah Carey was lovely. Stop anyways, it. Anyways. Um, I liked her doll. I do like how you can see everything. Um, <laughs> Let me rephrase that. Yeah, that's not right, Brian. Try again. Keep their dresses on, buddy. Whoa, um, Brittany. I do like how you can have the doll stand up and still see all their clothes on. Yes, the doll stands are nice because if you would have a regular doll stand, it would pinch it at the waist. So, like, Elsa's little capelet here would be squished in. Yeah, exactly. And it loses the dramatic flair, the I volume. guess. It loses all of this fanciness <laughs> if you have to squish it in. Anna um, would look very simple. Past that, like, if you would have said, hey, these are from Mattel and Disney, I'd been like, okay. Like, These guys look whatever. really good, though. Like, um, Anna has a lot yeah, of loose frizzies here, but... No, they're super good. She's like, got a lot of fur going on. The detailing on all of the clothes? It's amazing. really nice. The articulation? Amazing. Like, even look at her hands. Like, yeah. Nice fingers. I have to say, I am actually impressed for the price tag. Like, $100... Is a little steep. I'm not going to I wouldn't lie. pay $100 for these. $100. Bucks, I can see it. Like $15 a doll. $100 yeah. is a little steep. But when like the, when you look at the um, counterpart, like the cheapest Disney doll is like $11. And it is right. not my favorite doll. So like this, the most inexpensive Disney doll has like the plastic top with just like a skirt. Yeah, no. You can pull on. You remember that time we like did a Disney doll one and like we just shelved it because we're really, really negative. I think it was yeah. harsher than I needed to be on yep. her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we shelved it. Um, we did. But like she was generic city. Like, anyway, geez, stop. Amazing. Stop. Yeah, I agree. No, shh. Shh. <laughs> yeah. These are anyway. amazing. Like, look at her cape. I know. Look at they're that. so She's, pretty. She came with oven mitts. Amazing. <laughs> Do you want to wear them? Anna nope. always shares. No. Maybe we could put them on your horn. Um, Keep us all safe and your horn warm. My horn's always um. Who stabby. wants to see this? That's it. No, put our Brittany's I, horn. Brittany, come here, Brittany. Uh, come on, come on. Stop hey. it! Leave poor Philip alone. I need to vent my anger. Philip is lovely. <laughs> But no, I'd say like put a mid on his horn. For a hundred dollars, I still think a hundred dollars is slightly steep. Slightly. But I definitely understand the hundred dollar price tag. I mean, just Mariah Carey was like, what, seventy dollars? Yeah, she was like. So crazy. here you get two of them and they're fully articulated, unlike our celebrity dolls, which are not fully articulated. True. So you're getting a fully articulated doll, a rooted eyelash, and fully finished accessories. Mm -hmm. I understand the price tag. Yep. At $100, I actually think they're worth the price tag. Whoa. I really, really do. Considering, like, the other ones are $10 and, like, the $30 dolls are really, really nice. Do not get me wrong. Like, if you have a little and they want the $20 or $30 doll, go for it. The $10 doll, not my favorite. I don't have any of those in my collection for a reason. <laughs> but the $30 doll is actually really, really nice. But for a collector, I can see why you would want these. And I'm not going to say you're wrong. Like... These accessories are so nice. Like, Elsa is so nicely done. I see why the price tag is that high. I really, really do. It's all well and good. Now, hold on. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, Myth. Would you like to try some Tabasco? It's brewed in bathtubs in a mountain. Here. Well, that... <laughs> <laughs> you okay, Elsa? Whoa, that's spicy. <laughs> I feel like the Grinch. My heart's warmed up ten times. Well, um, you do like the fire. Ice pops stars. for everybody. Awesome. See, you see what Tabasco does? It brings people together. Yep. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Charles. I'm not moving. Okay. Fine. That's great. Uh, yeah, I would definitely say if you can get these on a flash sale for thirty bucks, do not hesitate. They are absolutely worth thirty dollars. 
I would actually say they're worth the MSRP too. Huh. Which for me is a rarity in yeah, saying that. You don't like spending full price. I do not. I often say that full price is for chumps. But <laughs> these dolls are really, really nice. If you're a big Frozen fan or you have a little who's a really, really big Frozen fan and they just want a very, very pretty doll, this is the this is the very, very pretty doll that they want. This is the one that they have seen in their head. This is this is the doll for all absolute Frozen fans. Mm. I would say, yep, that's the one. All the other ones you've seen, nope, not it. I like that one song from Frozen that goes, Ancestors here. Get out of here. Rude. <laughs> We're done. Anyway, <laughs> Anna and Elsa are lovely. Absolutely. Two thumbs up. I love them. No regrets in purchasing these dolls. Yeah, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. Is you. I'm going to take my friends and we're going to go watch <laughs> Frozen now. We need the cape back. Go away, Tim. And Does this mean the whole time, like next week, you're going to be like, I see how we finish each other's sandwiches. <laughs> Probably. And then that one song where you're like. I tried really, really hard and I succeeded. I did not sing, <laughs> even though I really, really want to right now. Which one are you going to sing? Hmm? Nope. What do you want to sing? Nope. Not going to do it. Do it. But look at the closure on this cape. Like it has Velcro no. on the inside. No. What so song? you don't see it and it just looks like it's actually the closure. Yeah, that's great. What song are we going to sing? Look at it. What song? Oh, it's lovely. I have to go play with my toys now. Did it go like this? Ancestors, hear our voice. That look is not even the words. That's not even the words. You bring honor to us all. But I think Anna needs a sled. <laughs> And a reindeer. And a Kristoff. Yes, please. <laughs> I need more toys. Okay, so if you're enjoying all of this Frozen content because you think it's one of the bestest Disney movies ever, and yes, I know I just said bestest. Did you say she needs a dermy? Everybody needs a dermy. Well, thank you. You can pretend to be fire spirit until we get a fire spirit. I don't even know what that means. That hurts me. That hurts me, dermy. Well, I'm sorry, but like he's never seen Frozen 2, and like the five minutes he saw of it, he was like, sleepy. You're right. I should find a new one. <laughs> Someone who will watch Frozen 2 with me. Look at my eyes. <gasps> Who's going to go see no. Frozen 3 with me? Look at these eyes. Everybody's going to go Frozen see Frozen 2. 3. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, there's a third one? Uh-huh. What is wrong with you people? Why? <sighs> I'll forget it. I'll take my dolls. <laughs> okay, that's it. If you enjoy these very, very pretty dolls and the best Anna and Elsa ever. Like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think of them. I think they're beautiful. I think there's a new alien movie coming out. That's more exciting than... Um, Is it about Anna and Elsa? For jo for fre Freezen? It's... Freezen? I mean, I guess a new alien movie is still a Disney movie. Technically, the Xenomorph is now a Disney queen. Why are we reviewing those toys, then? Because I like Anna and Elsa. They're pretty, and look at their dresses. Are any of them queens? They're like both queens. What? In Frozen two, two queens in a kingdom? They're in different kingdoms. There's a Frozen 2? <sighs> <laughs> I can't with these people anymore. I can't. Mm -hmm. Put her up I in the back on. That's probably true. Here you go, Anna. And that's all I have. <laughs> so watch me put these oven mitts back on my doll because she's going outside. It's summer here, but you know it's still really cold. It's still spring. Feels like 50 degrees today. Why is that a thing? It's too cold. <laughs> it's too cold. Why do I live in a place that is this cold? So not cool. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.